sensibilized to this uh, disease because it's a complex disease. Uh, by the way, now it's not very clear which are the etiological agents that could co could uh, induce this uh, pathology. And this is a very complicated pathology because it, uh, it in involves a lot of confound factors because au like auto autoimmune diseases, uh, like uh, multiple sclerosis and this kind of disease. Then people that has some, that exhibit some neurological uh, dysfunctions can be you know can can be related to 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 Lyme disease if they were uh, bitten by a, uh, a tick and then the problem is up to now in in Europe at least is that this disease is considered as uh, acute disease then the treatment is very simple two times uh, antibiotics during six weeks after this period, the social security of uh, European countries do not take in charge any other additional treatment. Then it's, this is very complex because uh, most of the persons that are were bitten by a, a tick uh, could exhibit long-term symptoms that are like a sort of uh, important variety of symptoms. Then uh, the clinicians are a little bit lost with that. What happened here? And then, by the way, s most of the clinicians think that Lyme disease is very simple to treat and uh, this is the reason why the, the people, uh, the governments do not consider uh, the, the chronical aspect of the disease, only the acute phase.